The first month of the year 2023 is over, and some of the movies that were set to come out in this year came out in this very month of January. So what are some of the best movies that came out in the month of January 2023? Let's find out. Megan, your goal is to protect Katie from harm, both physical and emotional. Megan. Megan is a horror thriller movie that came out early in the month on the 6th of January in theaters. According to the plot, Megan is a lifelike doll that is programmed to be a child's greatest companion and a parent's greatest ally. The work of the doll is to listen, watch and learn as she becomes a child's friend, teacher, playmate and protector. Gemma, played by Alison Williams, pairs a Megan prototype with her niece, Katie, played by Violet Bagro, who was recently orphaned. Thinking that Megan would help her ease her unexpected caretaking responsibilities, Gemma's expectations are cut short by the impending catastrophic events that follow. The film has an audience score of 78% and the audience says that as long as you aren't looking for something truly scary or even surprising, Megan is often a lot of fun. You should probably run. Who are you? It's me. It's Scott. Scott who? Teen Wolf the Movie After airing six seasons of the Teen Wolf TV series, Paramount Plus brought us the Teen Wolf movie on the 26th of January. According to the plot, all kinds of shapeshifters including banshees, were coyotes, hellhounds, kitsunes, and yes, even werewolves come back to Beacon Hills to fight a new evil. Starring Tyler Posse as Scott McCall, the true alpha gathers new allies and reunites trusted friends to fight back against what could as well be the most powerful and the deadliest enemy they've ever faced. The movie has an audience score of 80%. I'm still standing! My mom never came home from her trip. I don't know where she is. Missing. This film revolves around a young woman, June, played by Storm Raid, who, after her mother disappears on a vacation in Colombia, is hindered from finding her by an international red tape. As such, Jane uses all the latest technology at her disposal to try and find her mother before it's too late. Soon afterwards, she discovers that the deeper she digs, the more questions she uncovers than answers, and as she continues to unravel secrets about her mother, she realizes that she never really knew her at all. The movie was released on the 20th of January and has an audience score of 91%. The audience goes further to comment that if you look past the visual gimmicks, Missing makes for an edge of the seat thriller that's good at keeping you guessing. You need to let the police handle this. I tried, but we're running out of time. Listen carefully, this is an emergency. I'm Captain Brody Torrance. I like this guy. Plain. The movie, Plane, was released on the 13th of January and stars Gerald Butler as Brody and Mike Coulter as Luis. In this action thriller film, Gerard, being a pilot, lands his plane in a war-torn island after a lightning strike, saving the lives of his passengers. Afterwards, most of his passengers get taken as hostages by dangerous rebels. Gerard incorporates the help of Coulter, an accused murderer, to help him rescue the taken passengers. This film has an audience score of 94% and the audience comments are that you may need to check your critical thinking at the gate. The plot is preposterous and loaded with entertainment action, making plain plenty of good, old-fashioned fun. We're getting off this island. Hello. Hello. What's your name? Otto. Otto? O-T-T-O. I'm Abby. O-T-T-O. <laughs> a Man Called Otto. A Man Called Otto is a movie that came out in the 13th of January this year. It starred Tom Hanks as Otto Anderson and has an audience score of 97%. Generally, A Man Called Otto tells the story of a grumpy widower, Tom Hanks, whose only joy comes from criticizing and judging his exasperated neighbors. But when a lively young family moves in next door, he meets his much in quick-witted and very pregnant Marisol, leading to an unexpected friendship that turns his world upside down. The audience goes ahead to say that with a perfect Tom Hanks in the lead, a man called Otto is almost guaranteed to make you laugh and cry. 
You don't have a driver's license? How old are you? That brings us to the end of our list today. If you agree with our selections, please do drop it in the comment section below. Plus, if you have watched another great movie in the month of January, please do drop it in the comment section too. Remember to subscribe to our channel if you haven't yet, and be sure to check out some of our other videos. Till next time, see you in the comment section.